Google just leapfrogged every other AI company yesterday. And the internet is losing their freaking mind. Some of the updates I'm talking about. They released Veo 3, which is an incredible video generation model. Check this out. The biggest new feature that people are freaking out about this is that it actually generates audio with your video. Where were you on the night of the bubble bath? We're making full-on movies with this thing, complete with full-on dialogue. The film is in your ticket. They're watching the north exit. Use the service tunnel. That's all AI. Also do like audio effects, like the sound of wind. Pretty much anyone can now just make a cinema level quality film. The next feature they released, which is absolutely game changing for the entire industry is AI search mode. So now rather than just using Google search and getting the normal search experience, it actually lets you chat with it with similar to how ChatGPT does. And it's equipped with camera vision. So you can take a picture of something like a stack of books and it will search everything around the internet about those books. The way people search just changed forever. Also released Imogen 4 which might be better than ChatGP4O's image update. This is a picture of someone taking a selfie in the mirror, completely generated with AI using Imogen 4. Check out this Dino Festival poster that was made using Imogen 4. This is next level. I wanted to compare it against ChatGP4O with an exact same prompt, and here's what it did. My goal was to create a UGC creator holding an Olipop can. This one's Imogen 4, and this one is ChatGP4O. Let me know which one you think is better in the comments. Also, so many non-creative features that they launched yesterday that nobody's talking about. Their new coding agent called Jules, or their new automation suite called Mariner. But this shows looking for a recipe in a Google Drive folder and then ordering it on Instacart. Gemini 2.5 just got DeepThink. Did Google just beat OpenAI? Let me know what you think in the comments.